The sunshine returned to the Midlands, which means plenty of clear nights ahead with some perfect stargazing conditions. What will you be able to see across the Midlands this week? Here's meteorologist Corey Smith with the latest in your Skywatch forecast. We've made it to Wednesday once again, which means it's time to take a look at the night sky across the Midlands for this week. If you're up at night, really any of the time of the night this week, a great thing to view, the moon, a quarter moon right now, but getting closer and closer to our full moon next week. Pretty easily viewable here across the Midlands. And another thing that you can easily view in the morning hours are three planets in the morning sky. They're gonna be rising in the Eastern sky just about an hour to 30 minutes before sunrise. You can view Venus, Mars, and Mercury. In fact, Venus is gonna be the brightest of the year as you go through this week. So something to definitely keep an eye out and we have a lot of good viewing conditions for this as we head throughout the week. Maybe looking for a constellation? Well, my recommendation would be Ursa Minor. One of the smaller constellations out there, known as the Little Bear, contains the star Polaris. This was actually used as navigation back before we had all this technology like GPS and satellites uh, to navigate the world just because it sits directly in the northern sky and really doesn't move throughout the entire year. So definitely something to keep an eye out for. And the good news is a lot of good weather conditions this week. Outside of Saturday night and Sunday night, we're looking at mostly clear skies across the Midlands. The weather a lot quieter this week. And that means definitely get outside to view some of the things we talked about. If you get any pictures or videos, we'd love to see that on social media. So make sure to send it our way. From the studio, I'm News 19 meteorologist Corey Smith.